Good morning, guys. I can t honestly, that injection, bloody miracle. I'm not joking. I've had no pain in it whatsoever. And it worked straight away. My doctor said it could take two or three days for it to start working, but it worked straight away. So I'm going to make um, a school cake in this. And I'm going to make a Victoria sponge in these. So that's a seven inch cake and a school cake in a 12 by seven tray all at once. So I need 480 mils of whole milk. Oh, I've already got one open. I'm opening another one. Um, and in there, I'm putting a teaspoon and a half of vanilla extract. Just leave that to one side. And I want six ounces of butter, margarine, baking spread, which is what I use. They're perfect for cakes from Aldi. That's six ounces. That's a hundred and... Sorry, no, I need more than that. I need six ounces, but I haven't put six ounces in. I've just gone, all, just gone under. Is 170 grams. What a bloody awful day, isn't it? I was going to have a ride over to Darwin this afternoon to my sister in law's grave and take her some flowers, but I'm not going in rain because I like to sit and have a chat with her for a while, and there's a nice bench right next to her grave. Don't like calling it a grave, a little garden. There's a, a lovely bench right next to it and I like to sit there and have a chat. I don't think I'll go today if this carries on all day. Now I want Twenty ounces, which is five hundred and oops, sixty, five hundred and sixty grams of sugar, caster sugar, or if you haven't got any caster sugar and you can use granulated sugar, it's not a problem. At all. And four hundred and eighty grams of plain flour because I'm making two. You can use self raising flour if you like. Add two teaspoons of baking powder if you're using self-raising. If you're using plain like me, add. It didn't hurt. Two tablespoons of baking powder. Put that on medium speed and let those all combine. Whilst that's mixing, you want to add four large eggs. To your milk. We 
whisk that together with you. Milk and vanilla extract. Free whisking. Lovely. I love it. Pop your machine back onto your very slow speed, the slowest speed on your mixer, and start to pour your wet ingredients into your dry ingredients. making sure you've got all your dry ingredients in from the sides and from the bottom make sure they're not sticking at the bottom and then pour all the rest of your wet ingredients in your mixer back on a slow speed, the slowest on your mixer and just mix until they're combined. And then stop because you don't want it to sink in the oven. Alfie to work, bless him. He's on his work experience in a music shop and it's absolutely pouring down. He would have been soaked bit to skin by the time he got there. So I gave him a lift into town to his job. His little job. He's only doing it for three days because the shop's actually closed tomorrow. Oh, it's the day. The close fit day tomorrow. And uh, on Friday, he's, um, he's working Thursday, and then Friday, he's off to Iceland with the school. He's a lucky lad, he's been to Italy this year with school, skiing, which he very much enjoyed. And uh, he's going to Iceland for his geography on Friday for a week. Bless him. He's a very lucky boy. He's got a good mum. He works her butt off so that she can do what she needs to do for her boys. She makes me really proud. going to be a school cake and this is going to be a Victoria sponge Asked me for this for his mum. They're going in the oven now on 150 degrees electric fan oven for 40 minutes. 